story time with Butterfly the Clown. I'm so embarrassed. Andrew, said his mom, let's go to the mall. You need new shoes. No, said Andrew. You always embarrass me when we go to the mall. You always say you're not going to embarrass me, but you do embarrass me. No, I'm not going to the mall. I won't embarrass you. I promise, said his mom. Ugh, said Andrew, but he went anyway because he really needed new shoes. Just at the door of the mall, Andrew's mom said, Oh, Andrew, you didn't comb your hair. So Andrew's mother spit on her hand and patted Andrew's hair until it was all flat. Oh, oh, yelled Andrew. Spit? Mom, you spit on my hair in the mall? Very, very embarrassing. Oh dear, oh dear, said Andrew's mother. I'm sorry about the spit. I keep forgetting how big you are. Don't worry, I will be very, very careful not to embarrass you again, huh, said Andrew. So Andrew and his mom went walking in the mall and Andrew saw his aunt. Please, please, said Andrew, don't say hello to kissy aunt. Oh, Andrew, said his mom, I have to say hello. So Andrew's mom said hello to kissy aunt and Andrew's aunt gave him a big hug and a large wet kiss all over his face and left lipstick marks on his face. Ugh, yelled Andrew. Lipstick, hugs, and kisses? Lipstick, hugs, and kisses in the mall? I think I'm going to die. Ugh. Andrew hid up in a tree. Andrew's mom and his aunt talked for three hours. And then she said, Andrew, Andrew, where are you? Where are you? Why are you up in that tree? <sighs> I'm definitely going to get lost if I don't stop getting hugs and kisses. Hugs and kisses in the mall. Hugs are nice, said Andrew's mom. Hugs and kisses in the mall? Ugh, said Andrew. Then they walked some more and Andrew saw his teacher. Please, please, said Andrew. Please, please do not say hello to my teacher. But his mom yelled, hello, oh teacher, hi, hello. Oh, Andrew says you're the best teacher that he's ever had. And he's so happy that he has you for a teacher. Oh, would you like to see some of Andrew's baby pictures? Oh, isn't he cute? Oh, I just love his baby pictures. Oh, oh, Andrew yelled, baby pictures? Ah, oh, Andrew said his mom, stand beside your teacher so I can take your picture. Click, click, click. Andrew ran away. His mom found him and said, Andrew, why are you hiding behind the trash can? Baby pictures? said Andrew. Baby pictures you showed my teacher? Baby pictures? Very embarrassing. You promised you were not going to embarrass me. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Look, said Andrew, how about you stay here and I see my friend Taylor J from school. I'll hang out with her and you go shopping. That's a good idea, said his mom. Taylor J, Taylor J, said Andrew, I'm going nuts. My mom is embarrassing me all over the mall. I'm glad you were here. So my mom will leave me alone. Maybe you should not be so glad, said Taylor J. Here comes my mom. Taylor J's mom came up and said, Taylor J, do you want me to buy pink underpants or yellow underpants? Ugh, 
said Taylor J. Underpants in a boy's face? Andrew and Taylor J. ran across the mall and jumped into the trash can. After a while, their moms came and knocked on the trash can. Andrew, said his mom, why are you in the trash can? I am here because you're embarrassing me, said Andrew. Me too, said Taylor J. I don't believe it. Underpants in a boy's face? No, no, said their moms. You're just too sensitive. You shouldn't let things bother you guys so much. Okay, said Andrew and Taylor J. Then this won't bother you. They both jumped out of the trash can, ran in the middle of the, the mall, and yelled very loudly, Our moms snore like grizzly bears and blame it on our dads! <gasps> both of the moms yelled, Ah! And they both jumped in the trash can. Andrew, Andrew and Taylor J knocked on the trash can. And their moms yelled, how can you embarrass us so? Well, said Andrew and Taylor J, we had good teachers. The end.